He's complaining. And he's out of position. And now they're looking to break down here, but the whistle went early. We're here with the quarterfinal of the InSport Primary League. It's Clarkstone Primary up against Calnaldi from Montego Bay. Uh, primary uh, Clarkstone there in the red and white. Calnaldi pink. Pink top with pink stripes to the side of the shorts. And they have the early showing into the attacking third. Rockstone is number seven, shows good touch initially. No really turn to it yet. It's really early in this one and just looking to see young talents at this age. It's about playing, allowing them to play, express themselves. Uh, you don't want the talent to be suppressed by overcoaching or too much tactics to this one. You want natural talents to prevail. And more often than not at this level it is the natural talents that win you game but you do technicality is what you look out for and spatial awareness from players so Clarkstone being pinned into their half early in this one unable to come out second throw in in succession now did they have traveled with some level of support one of the littlest players on the field showing a lot of <laughs> vim and vigor, physicality to it as well. That's speculative. I don't think that was a shot from Colonel's number four. Just looking to watch the ball. Go on, pop it. So number five looking to swing that, that's not a bad ball inside. And number nine just closed down quickly. And that effort has been torted somewhat. Canaldi in possession with number nine here. Good challenge there from the number four for Clarkstone. He's one of the better players. He's left footed playing on the left side, but is a no nonsense player. I had the privilege of meeting him about two years ago when he was in grade four and I felt he's progressing quite nicely um, so looking forward to see his playing today if, if Clarkstone primary are to get past this round you figure he's going to have to have a good game this one throwing there to Carnaldi number five pass back to him to swing inside and number seven under it under some pressure the number three was right there holding his head so referee obliged to stop the contest might not have been a foul in that one I don't think there was both players had eyes for the ball but in the early going here Colonel they seem to show the more desirous of the attacking intent they're looking good passing forward but Clark's down yet to get into their gear doing a lot of defending Normally this contest is played over two legs. 
but I think it's a shortened version because of the start of the competition. I think the local government election affected it somewhat and with the first arriving PEP exams, I think they want to get it out of the way. So this is just a one leg. So the winner moves on to the semi-finals. It's a big contest, a lot at stake here. Now the temporary donor player. Come on, Gossip. Come on, get the ball. Good play there, good Again, by the number four. Yeah. He's managed to hold off the pressure showed from the number six for Colin. This is the number four. Showing good ball handling skill. Possibly. It's blocked. Good position from the number six. I think from Crabstone. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come Yeah, yeah, then. Then. Pass the ball. The ball. Come on. Very penetrative run. And then Just needed to check his run. Just hold a little bit. Maybe just one touch too many for the number nine. This age, they're always going to be eager to go forward. But showing good intent early is Fernando Crabstone. Still trying to get into this one. I think it's about the assertiveness for Good pass in there from the number five to six. Good challenge again from the number four. So good defensive work there and again. So far showing good signs in defense. Not diving in too early. And now they're on the transitional play here. Good tracking by Traxton, number three. Why, Peppa, why you do that, sir? You hear the whistle? It's looking purposeful to go wide. It's not matter, listen to the whistle. Whistle play football. Just played outside by Carnaldi's number. You know, fucking army. Journey in! You know, see my freedom, that's all, watch out. Signs as if they have so much of coaching and good technical skills as well, always looking to pass it at this stage. And yellow card shown to the corner of the player for the infringement. Seems to be raising or feeling in hand. Got into the eye of Stone's number eight. Yellow card of the contest. 
soon to Canal Dis number six. himself. Challenge from him and looks like he's into the game. Now he's caught out and he's out of position. And now they're looking to break down here, but the whistle went early. So the whistle went before the shot. And Put the ball in the back of the net, the referee whistle, in all fairness, went early. Why is he going to kick in at that thing, Goldie? Can I have a So looking to restart the game. Referee will do so now. Clarkstone down a man. And really haven't been looking at the ball inside to the number nine. You have a goal, it looks like. That's a good shot at goal. But the goal keeper right behind it. Good, 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 good football all round. Good shot. Positioning of the goalkeeper was very good. And just monopolizing possession here. Dead board of good move from him. So, uh, the supporters crying out for it, but that was clear for him. Looked as if he or she was going to play the advantage. Clear point, just waiting for to see if anything would materialize. And I know the, the fans are crying out for it. And if he had gotten away and the whistle went, they would be the same one saying it should not have been caught. So, yeah. Referees, yeah, show the yellow card now. So the yellow card, so yellow card a piece. Number three for Carnaldi and the number three for Clark Stone. So yeah, opposing numbers has been shown the yellow card. So, Canaldi, acute angle, wall build with three in it, but he goes for it straight into the wall. Number six, he got away from the player, lovely play from him again inside. And Canaldi now 
the victim to regain possession. Clarkstone just cannot seem to put uh, a spell of possession together. Come on, come on. Trying to just win it here, but come on, already. They have been showing better possession of skills. Their best player with the ball to throw in. Could be a long day for Clarkstone from the evidence of what we've seen early in this one. It's a funny old game. Just take one goal. Come on, ball, be Even on, without pressure, they're looking to just play that ball hey. one time and kick it away, not intending to pick players out. And Carnaldi's purpose in this one, they have been good in terms of knitting passes together. So Clarkstone, a lot of their plays occurring in their half and for Carnaldi as well, in their half. Just it! just positioned well. Walking a walking green on the field. 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 The going on to becoming good players from this tender age but the attitude has to be right because here he was complaining to the referee arms in the air while the number nine was still bearing down on goal and that was poor because had it gone into the back of the net he would have conceded a goal and with all his berating or complaining it would be a goal down you play until the danger has been averted is what you wanted coach your players to do. Early substitution for Clarkstone, the player that went down will not return. So the number 18 is no win. And the switch to the number 8, he'll have to play, which is the skipper, he'll have to play centre at the back. Carnal is number 5, look to serve this one in. That was a poor one that went behind. And Clarkstone will have a chance to reorganise themselves and, and try and settle this one. You get the feeling, the instructions from the coach of Clarkstone, it's got to be for these players to really put a few passes together. They're just turning over possession too easy and as such they're on the defensive for the most part of this contest. So some issue with the, the goal post needing to be realigned to make sure that it's on the goal line. It's very important goal is because that's really what everybody plays for. The worst thing you want is to have some sort of a dispute or controversy if a ball goes into the back of the net and maybe needed to have been firmly grounded here. There's a strong wind blowing from north to south somewhat northeastern. Nice on the ball, good composure to show, but just a bit too close. And the number four for Clarkson so had to make the challenge. Referee just letting him know just to calm it down a bit. But that was just a bit too close the pass from the number nine to the number five out wide. But he's one of the better players, the number nine from Carnaldi. Number five, not a bad player as well. Certainly have a good number of players on this one. And you get the feeling from their possession, they should be the ones in front. And have made it pay. Clarkson have defended well. Oh, wide again, good defensive header from Clarkstone. Just putting this, looking to shape up to keep that one in the center. They've got this close down very quickly for him in the turn. Clarkstone, again, just calmly putting the passes together, looking to build possession for the turn. Tent to double from the passes. Dylan, get back, get back! By number 17 from Clarkstone. And Dylan! Female on the Man, get off your work, man. Get back, man. Do your work. Get back. That's what it has been. That's pretty much the story of the game. 
Canaldi attacking, touchdown defending. But we have to appreciate both aspects of the game. Defending is a part of the game. And maybe for scouts here, they will probably see good attacking players from Cranaldi, but certainly you can't build a team just on attack and you want a good de solid defensive structure and maybe that's down showing some players who should do that. Oh, Riding on this game, you feel from the utterance of the coaches, you know they really want this one. Yo, come out here. Come here. Oh, push pressure. So, you know, a little bit of a conference it, it. between it. Chat. number finish. six and number three. He's telling the coach, showing confidence, saying to the coach, just calm it down, coach. We're, we're, we're planning our stuff here. Whistle and I like that with players. The fact that they have their own thought process. And sometimes we coach out decision making with young players. You don't want to do that. You don't want to every moment tell them what they ought to do. Especially when they're on the ball. That's when you don't want to do it. And he says training, but he's saying he's, he's working it out. And it's six and seven, six will go for it. And Straight into the wall, didn't come off, but they have another chance. The number five looked to get it inside. Cox down to the line. Come on, Nash, I'm just going to click. Second. Come on, you. 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 Showing a lot of confidence he is. The central defender for Carnaldi. Number seven here for Cox down. Number four, again, he's challenging, but he had a chance to just keep possession. Good play there from the number nine. Lovely ball outside now to the number seven. He looks to strike. Didn't really get hold of that one. Kick into the turf. But lovely game. A play again from the number nine. Really love him as a player. And also the number five. He always creates win. It's the five or the seven. And they're always. That's a good sign. Spatial awareness is key. The number four here he pushes it a little bit too long, you feel, but he wins a throw in. And you now they will look to go again. Cracks down, throwing. Again, yeah, the the So far, but it's a long way from that. But they're looking like they're playing for that good challenge again from Gladstone. The number nine, he got away from the number four best defender. He's weaving his way through. Oh, just pulled that one or dragged that one wide. That was a weaving, majestic, really majestic run from the number nine, weaving his magic through this Gladstone defense. And you know it was a good dribble because he got past the number four as well, which is the best defender there. But just dragged the shot wide in the end. But really love to watch him already. Close him down, his work rate is as well. Look at that skill showed by the defensive the defender there, the number 13, who's always the player back for Carnaldi. But yeah, it's called the national already. A little bit mindful of that concerns when those names get banded about quite easily, they lose their way quite quickly. But that's what it is in Jamaica. Number four again showing good skills. And again, just not that pass. Number four here looking to go. Will he break? Uh, no. Just four for the number 13 for, for Clarkstone. The number nine here for Carnaldi. Look again to get away from the number four. He does. And then he gets inside. That looks like a good. Yeah, that was a lovely run again. But good positional play from the goalkeeper for Clarkstone. But again, the number nine. Just lovely to watch him work his, his way through here to a maze of players and still got off a shot in the end. So, yeah, he's the best player on the park so far. Is Carnaldi's number nine. Again, ball over from the number six, Carnaldi. Clarks down again, looking to clear their line. Not too far, comes to the number seven. Good touch by him. Turns inside, looks to pass up the field, but again, not to a player. Ready to go. Joshua! 
it to the lines to the number seven for Carnaldi. Looks to clear field to their number five. I think number six it is. Back to the number five. Look to swing inside, but intercepted here by Clarkstone. But yeah, handled ball by the number sixteen. Hey, one does get back, go back to Jordan. Yeah, number nine just lovely. Hey, hey, you step up, step up, step up. And I have power enough. Step up, step up. Why you just stay up there? Get back. win that all day long you get the feeling good defender just shielding quite well and yeah gets away with it and bang the ball up field the number 12 for Clarkson it comes right back at them though number seven for Carnaldi put it to his left side it looks like he's right footed so looking to come back on the right side that's always going to favor the defender who gets a touch and bang it up field is the number four for Clarkson Carnaldi will come back with it again stop him now yeah he's twisting and turning getting away from one getting away from two but the first one recovered the number nine and again just a ball of field it goes to number seven he's looking to switch the point of attack and good intention from him just to make contact with it well and Carnaldi's number nine is on the ball. He's weaving his way again. Every time he gets it, it's a mazy run. And that ball to the number seven, probably just over eight, and he was flat the number seven, so couldn't really trap that one. But again, showing good time. So, Clarkstone again. Yeah, number four. He's the better ball handler, but. Hey, hey, second time, I'm gonna fall in my man. Take care of five feet, man. Hey, yeah, the whistle. Might have been tugged back, I agree. We just had to play to the whistle. So, number four back on the park, and I know they're going to do everything to try and get him back on the park. This clock's down number four. He's certainly a, a lovely player. I really love to watch him. He has his hands full, I'd say. He has his, his feet well occupied here. He's going to have to think it out a lot. Just need to improve his, his attitude towards the game and make sure that he plays to the whistle. Uh, just showing too much style on too early. I think it's an infringement. He stops playing. Here he is. Sizing up good defensive play, just not selling himself too early. Now that cross inside. And Clarkstone defending well. Good watching of the ball there, but Carnaldi they comes away with it. And he's looking for the strike here. Good block again from Clarkstone. Booting off field. Right, he's 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 he looks to hold it up. Good body feeling able to get away. Again, his size is not fatal in him. And he's all on his own and he loses out to Carnaldi. Again, he's crowded out. Carnaldi, number seven, looking to get away from the 13. Taught it somewhat. Lovely ball across oh, field. God, Comes to the first touch. That was beautiful from the number five, five and six. Exchanging passes. Good shot just outside. I think that one went out before the goalkeeper touched it, but the referee calls for a corner. But lovely link up play from five and six. They've been doing it all game. And when you bring the number nine in it, you have class. Here's the number six, good one time cross inside. That just breaks for Carnaldi, almost to the number nine, but breaks. And again, it's out for a corner kick. Blackstone has been doing pretty much the defending. Carnaldi, the attacking. This is what it has been. 
if you want the perfect team at this level maybe these are the two teams in half one very good defending one very good attacking and that's the half time break nil o'clock some will say some will say the neutral will say they're lucky to be still in it but you have to appreciate the defensive side of the game and sometimes we go to the football game all we want to see is the attacking but it has been some good defending from Clarkstone they're gonna have to get the other aspect of their game going we're not quite sure if Carnal they defends well because Clarkstone really haven't tested them but at half time it's one it's nil off Get up, 
Hey, no more fire pause. When you get when you get over. Yeah, I'm come up, come up, see you and I'll be you. Yeah, 
team chance to... Got the beat, I got the stop it first! Go, step out, go, chill! Uh, yeah. One line, come on, one line, one line! That was a good yeah. shot. Yeah. 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 Use of the 
Wonderful play there by the number nine player for Clarkstone. For Colonelly. There's going to be a change of play. Change is going to go in by the number nine for Clarkstone. Now he's going in for 
Kill him. Kill him. Kill him. Kill him. Kill That one, that one was a good shot there. No, number four is in position of the ball, going down the line nicely. He's trying his best to cross it over. Yeah, man, that is a wonderful save there by the keeper. Step up now! No! 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 Watch your look up. Go down, go down, Papa, cut him, Papa, eh? Wonderful shot. Yeah, and it goes out for a turn in for a turn in. There's a way past stabbing right here. I want to play. Let's try again, stop. I'm going back. Yo! Get 
37 minutes. Okay. Yeah, so much, yeah. time much time left for you. Long time. Referee, much time leave. Holly, leave, Holly. Holly, Holly. Referee, much time left. Referee, much time left. Referee, much time left. Referee, much time left. Oh, cut in! Cut in, Pepper! <laughs> Chop Chop Boss, you know, I'm here presenting for Jamaica Street Sports, you know, the real sports. You know. Check them out on YouTube, Instagram, everywhere. You know. Subscribe, like, and share. That is it. Chop Chop Boss represent. God on time. Charlie! Representing for Jamaica Street Sports. I would have full job the sports right now. Up and running, you know, advanced. I represent Jamaica Street Sports. I'm going to say, I don't know if I'm going to tell you, I'm going to call away. We know nobody can, nobody never want away. We make the money, everybody wants to swim away. Street Sports, them run chill on it. Man. <laughs>